Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Um, the easiest way to install GNU Radio Companion in your Mac OS, in your MacBook Pro, uh, simply go to your web browser and simply type in Radio Conda. So once you type in Radio Conda, you will see this first link. Just simply hit that link. So once you open up this link uh, and go to this download section. So once you go to your download section, you will find it a complete package which is downloadable for Linux, for Mac OS, and for Windows. You can also, if you're looking for an older version of GNU Radio Companion, just simply go to this link. You will find an older version of it. The version that we are interested in for our Mac OS is actually this one, which is being released right here. This is a graphical version. Just simply click on it. It will start downloading the link. So once you download this particular package, I have already downloaded, so it's there in my finders folder right here. This is the package. I have downloaded actually two different versions, an older version and a newer version. So just simply double click on it and run this package. Once you start click, once you double click on it, it will start running the package. So I think if you're installing it for the first time, what it will ask you that uh, do you trust this is this package is being downloaded from some unidentified developer do you want to actually go with it in order for you to bypass this just simply go to your uh, system preferences and go to security and privacy and just allow it uh, just simply type in your whatever the password is type in your password and allow it and just do the uh, click on the icon open anyway once you open this, uh, it, you will see it right here. App Store Random File, you will see this package. But I've already corrected that, so I don't need to do it. So the next step is, once you have this, just simply continue, 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 and hit Agree. It will some might ask you to enter your passcode or password. I've already done it, so just simply hit Continue and once this start writing all the files that requires makes a path it will take care of all the prerequisite and uh, the repositories that you need to run this efficiently onto your computer uh, so you don't need to worry about downloading it individually so this is a very nice package and you're ready to use this once it's being uh, uh, installed in onto your computer on your macbook so i'll come back to this video and and I'll show you what you need to do afterwards. So after that one minute mark, mark uh, it will state that installation was complete successfully was completed successfully. Just hit the close button. Let's keep the package to ourselves, and we're good to go. So now where is the package? So hit command and a space bar and just simply type GNU radio and we should find GNU radio if not that's perfectly fine just simply go to your terminal once you hit terminal once your terminal is open and just to see if the package is there GNU radio companion and hit enter once you hit enter and let's see if I have so it will have let's see wait for it to open let's wait a couple more seconds and beautiful just simply minimize this here we have it here we have it and what is the version of this GNU radio that you have just installed so basically go to help and about you got GNU radio 3.10.7.0 which was actually released on 26th of July 2023 okay so what's inside of this GNU radio what are the packages which are there uh, in GNU radio companion if you know there are things called out of tree modules and the things there's a base GNU radio companion and there's some modules which people have made and you can download them and compile them which will become part of your GNU radio the cool thing about this version is you will find all the major out of tree module that is already being compiled there so for example if you own Adelum Pluto 
you don't need to actually compile it it's already there it's already part of this package which is the which is the coolest thing and there's a lot of different packages which are there you have digital rf you have gpredict you have rms lite so beside your core modules uh, which is actually all of this you will get out of tree modules as well uh, which include all of these you have 82.11 82.15.4 <coughs> excuse me and you also have osmo sdr so you can also connect your uh, rtl sdr dongle or hack rf to your GNU radio companion so that's the cool thing about it. Uh, it 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 contains beside those core modules some of the very important uh, modules uh, that you need that are already pre-compiled -pre in this particular version of GNU radio companion so i hope you like this small tutorial on how to easily and what is the easiest, simplest, and the fastest way to, to, to install GNU Radio? In this way, you don't need to worry about your X codes and things like that. It already, this particular package take care of all, take care of all of this. So I hope you like this small tutorial on how to actually install this. And if you have any questions, leave it in a comment section and don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel.